Good morning guys and welcome back to the channel. Now you join me here on a rather dark and grey weekend here at Beachy Head but the car I've got here will definitely brighten up the day. I've been on a bit of a mini adventure over the past sort of month trying to find the best mini you can buy in 2019. Now I drove the Mini Cooper S about three weeks ago or so and I thought that was fantastic but there were a few things that I would have liked to have. Now Chandler's Mini in Hailsham gave me a ring and said Damien we've got a JCW that looks well looks amazing and there's a few things on there that are quite unique so well I'm hardly going to go no. <laughs> so this car here as you were saying it's the JCW great car anyway but the thing that makes this quite exciting is it's got the pro tuning pack from JCW so we've got an absolutely incredibly loud exhaust and that's the one thing I thought was missing but I'm really looking forward to getting behind the wheel of this we've got the larger 19 inch wheels what do you reckon on the price you're probably wrong I think they're about 1800 pounds on this so that's not a cheap option. We've got the optional fog lights at the front, and I think that sets off carbon wing mirrors. We've got black uh, windows. We've got black uh, door mirrors and petrol cap, red stripe running through it. And also what you can't see under there, we've actually got lowering springs on it. So the handling on this, I'm expecting to be even better. The only thing that does do away with is adaptive damping that's it you can't have the pro pack with all of that on but other than that look at it really looking forward to actually getting out on this and giving my opinion I'm not going to talk too much about the tech because I did that in a previous video so I'll put a card up there so I think really most importantly we need to get out on the road <laughs> the series I'm doing trying to find the best Mini in 2019. I drove the three-door Cooper S and I thought that was a fantastic car but there were a few changes that I would have liked to make. Now I had a chat with my friends at Chandler's Mini in Halsham and they happen to have another Mini Cooper but it's slightly different. This is the JCW version so if you don't know about JCW, that's John Cooper Works, and they basically tune the Cooper S. So this model here, we're putting out 228 brake horsepower. So it is, it feels a lot quicker than uh, the Cooper S. Don't get me wrong, that was not a slow car, but this is fantastic. It's got every optional extra you could ever want. Every pack has been applied to this car. But not only that, the thing that makes this special, it's got the Pro Tuning Pack. Now this model has got the automatic eight speed dual clutch gearbox. So we can either control it from the uh, paddles on the steering wheel, we can leave it in automatic mode, normal, automatic sport. So to go into automatic sport is push across. So that's in sports mode now. And if I want to start using the pedal paddles why wouldn't you you just push forward again and now I've got complete control over this car now we're gonna head back to this rather tasty exhaust on this thing we've got doesn't look much now this here this is how you turn the magic on it's a Bluetooth controller for the exhaust so like the other mini you have got twin exhaust but there's a valve in one of these and that opens up when you press the button. And there's pops, there's cracks, there's blips. 
jumps on up change, this thing, well, let's have a listen. We are in fourth, let's drop it, third, second. <laughs> yep, and this bumpy back road, this car is handling it. It's got upgraded suspension as well. It's got Schnitzer lowering springs on it and it just makes it that much more compliant. You can... <laughs> this is so much fun. Under the bonnet we've still got the same fantastic two litre engine that we found in the standard Mini Cooper S but JCW have worked their magic and it's 228 brake. I think it may be slightly more with the pro tuning kit but certainly the torque is up now to around 300 foot pound so it certainly pulls. Inside now we had a look at the previous one if you want to know more about the interior again that was in my previous video but in here this has got every optional extra the things i wanted we've got a head-up display directly ahead of me which is really nice so you can change the settings on there i've got it in sports mode so all i've got is a rev counter and my speed over on the left now this is a big upgrade this is uh 2700 pounds but you get the large 8.8 .8 inch screen instead of i think it's six and a bit but also you get lots of extra goodies on there you can have split screen the sat nav's been upgraded you get real-time traffic alerts it's also got the top of the range stereo in here so that sounds absolutely fantastic we've got lighting pack as well i think pretty much everything the steering wheel I absolutely love this the previous one i drove did have this jcw steering wheel but it's it's fantastic feels really good in the hands again left hand side for cruise control right hand side you've got for control stereo and voice control everything is exactly where you want it these Recaros are lovely they're really really supportive they look fantastic they've got the jcw badge just behind me and oh it's a perfect driving position and now i can start having some fun this this thing is it's eating these corners i think any car would struggle to keep up with this it feels it's pretty firm to be honest but it sounds fantastic it's it really is the ultimate in mini go-casting here. I'm, well, I, to say impressed is an understatement. Let's go down to second. We've got a nice straight and... Christmas. Now this, this has got to be the best Mini I've driven. Just in pure handling and everything else. It's, it's blooming fantastic. I want to say other words, which I can't quite get over how good this car is. Oh. <laughs> up speed there's no turbo lag on this at all 300 foot pound of torque it fires you out the corners just down change and well you can hopefully get an idea of how good this thing is this car well it's bloody wonderful I thought the other one was good but this just takes it turns it up to 11 this 
I think this would be the Mini I would buy. If I was going to go out and get one, it would be this. The only thing that's really sad, you cannot get this exhaust anymore. They don't sell it. So the only way is getting a used one. That's, it's a shame. And that, that to me is really bringing this car alive. I've not driven the JCW without it, but the handling on this, the sounds, it's a real visceral experience, this. There we go. Oh, it's, well, perfect. In my eyes, this, it might be too much for some people, but for me, and I think a lot of people out there, you, anyone who's a petrol head would want the loud, shouty version of this car. And it is, it's not overly loud, to be honest. And the wonderful thing is, if you're driving along normally, you can put it in, ooh, feels dirty this, green mode. Um, and just, it's quite sensible and you could do longer distances in it, probably no problem whatsoever. So it's practical, you've got the same four seats in here, so leg space, passenger room, boot size, everything is exactly the same. It's just been, as I said, it's been dialed up to 11. I'd even say 12 on this one, but absolutely love this car. It's so good. Well, it's come to the end of my day here with this Mini JCW and it's been fantastic. So a massive thank you to Chandler's Mini in Halsham. I've really enjoyed my time with this and what better place to finish off this video. Absolutely beautiful around here. Wonderful car. These roads have been absolutely amazing. So guys, I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. Comments are always welcome. And remember to click on that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.